Alrighty, should we do what I think we're about to do? Kick off a show? Oh, we're do going Ashton song. All right. I think I might have programmed in a. I, let, I love Ashton. I love Ashton, but we've been giving the listeners yeah. a brand new song. Let's try this one. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, all oh, right. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. A little world mini the aftermath world here. Mini <laughs> we cat. are in it, boys. Uh, oh, yeah. Wes, Chase, and Jason Crane coming to you from. Um, the gun club here the at World club. Mini. Yeah. After a very long and exciting, very somewhat long. dusty week. You guys know why it's the gun club? I'm windburnt. Oh, oh look at those. Look at those. He did, dude. I saw Crane. Stop he did. Stop it. Yeah. I We're saw back. him do three push ups this week. I think Jet Rao and, uh, oh, yeah. and Jade Smart might have something to say about your guns. Yeah, they definitely do. Their they muscles were. after carrying them trophies this week uh, are going to be bigger <laughs> than those. The amount of kids who I had to help carry their trophies back when I was filming was hilarious. They were like, yeah. hey, how am I going to get this back? Grayson, <laughs> Grayson Towns, uh, his hands had to have been smoked. I was yeah. like, dude, I got you, bro. So we're, we're sitting here talking about World Mini. Uh, we've been out here April 4th through 7th, 2024 this year uh, for a little archive. Here, I think we left April 2nd. Second. What day is it? We've been here a long damn time. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I, don't, I don't even know. Uh, Crane's got to get on the road to head back to Idaho with a massive trailer full of stuff. You cannot Chase fit a I, magazine in there. No, and Chase and I are going to, uh, and how all this stuff is going to fit, Crane, I have no idea. Chase and I have to go to Vegas for Pulp. I'm sorry, you're going to figure it out, That's going to be full booster seat, me on a Pelican case. Uh, for 12 hours. Yeah, we'll home. have two more Pelican cases on the pedal so I can reach them. Hey, good we'll for you, man. You're, we'll you're going you're gonna to figure it out. Uh, so we're here to talk about the event, uh, a little bit of standouts. Thankfully, there was no Supercross, so we don't have to say oh, anything about this this past nothing. weekend. Suck it, Jet Lawrence. We would have no idea what happened nope. there. So Zero. I'm glad there's nothing to recap. Uh, only thing we got to talk about is AC retiring, but we'll probably do that on Pulp tonight. He's on the show. That he little, is on the show that tonight. That little radio show. That little radio. Wait, show. are we? Is our Plup? show going to beat oh, Pulp's out? Pulp. It. We're going to beat Pulp's yeah, show. Plup. No, it's Pulp. Pulp. Oh yeah, we get to be on with Rayson Mathis tonight. Rayson Mathis on Pulp. Speaking of, uh, so uh, Plup did come. <laughs> Brixton Rayson Mathis. He came out to uh, World Mini on Friday to experience the culture, the racing, yep. the event. We decided in. to uh, dig into the archives, find the bottom line, show graphics and song, brought it back to life. We're going to bring it. Uh, we're going to launch it tonight during Pulp, I believe. Yep. So everybody's going to have to listen in and uh, know when to go go I, to the Bird Moto YouTube and watch. I have not watch. seen it. I have not seen it. It's great. It okay. is so good. It's awesome. I will tell you. So I had to prove it. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be well, awesome. Wes approved every clip and how they were edited in this video. Yes, Wes. Wes, Wes approved I, it. Chase has not seen anything. <laughs> Wes approved every clip. Chase has so not I'm, seen I'm very anything. excited for uh, racing to see how this came together. Uh, but anyways, I think he actually enjoyed the amateur ranks. He came here. Nothing but smiles. Nothing cool. but smiles. He was so excited to come just Happiest immerse I've himself Happiest in, I've ever seen him. in the amateur scene. I've been cool. working with Steve for, so I worked with him in beginning in 2011 at Racer X. So I've known Steve for a long time. And I, honestly, this is the happiest I've ever seen. Yeah, him. he was never that enthused about amateurs. But yeah. now that he came here, he, he might have changed his mind. He, he might go plop amateur mx or plop amateur.com or something he's going to start a whole I, I new th site i think St steve and the amateurs are just they've it's always been waiting to happen we yeah. bought, like we've pushed it away he's pushed it Two away worlds and now he saw world mini and those worlds collided at world yes mini. they did well like going back to ac i actually get to take credit for this i remember the moment steve said hey can you give me this ac kid's phone number and i was uh with i was actually with ac at the time and him and uh zach freeberg i think uh it was like 2011 or 2012 we were at waldo I was doing a unit photo shoot, unit clothing. Unit? Oh yeah. Wow. Uh, I didn't even, never shot a photo at the time and I had to shoot photos anyways. I was like, I sent, I think AC was the first uh, amateur, first and only amateur ever on Pulp. Uh, and I connected those dots and AC's kind of been Pulp's uh, am Plup's amateur Plup. Yeah. Plup. Since, uh, since then. And uh, now that AC's retiring, I think he came here and, and, and he saw what he's yeah. been missing and yep. what he, you know, with AC gone, he needs to fill that hole. He needed Wes to go find him another little kid to become his his guy. The, yeah, the Plup and maybe, and and, but maybe there's all the little kids that are now the Plup MX riders. The Plup, it could be a Plup sponsorship program in the future. Just throwing that out. There. Every every 14 years, every Plup, 14 years. Plup gets a new amateur. <laughs> Plup gets a new amateur. Hey, when you pick him right, man. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, um. Here we are in the gun club. We've been editing back here. When I say we, uh, Crane's been doing a lot of photos. I've been just doing photos, video, posting on the site. Yep. All kinds of stuff, helping the boys video dump cars. But uh, our boy Casey and Will Posey. Crushed. 
sat back there all week. All Literally, week. they never left this gun club. No, uh, no. The track's about a quarter mile that way. <laughs> well, what you didn't um, see is you guys don't see the ball and chains we have over there. Yeah. They're coming in the morning. Oh, we well, lock I, them down. I made sure to move that before the oh, video. Oh, Good job, dude. Good job. <laughs> so, uh, we, you know, we, we kind of did a lot of fun things this week. Uh, some some highlight clips that were more podcasty with Zach Heron and Kevin Kelly. Yeah, yeah. amazing. And then uh, yesterday we went uh, full old school verb, did some interviews with tons of race highlights and, and fun things. So... Uh, just experimenting with some race coverage, seeing what really works, what was really fun. But uh, nonetheless, our uh, we don't have to slave drive anymore because they're gone. We're not. We so sent them home. We did send them home. Sent them home. The cool thing is we gave everyone their own free video. Yeah. Well, not everyone, but a lot of them. There were some kids that were stoked on that, having their photos and videos and like yeah. just being able to go home and edit your own stuff. Yeah. yeah. It was just so cool for them. In, in, the, in the world of amateur racing where there's so many options and a lot of great races, honestly, uh, the, the bar is so high. Massively high. Um, and, you know, for us trying to break back into this world and do our own unique events, it, it's been tough to say what, what is, I, I don't know, this is the dumbest shit to say, but the verb difference. Like, yeah. I, we've never once called it that, by the way. No. I'm just uh, till trying. Now. Till yeah. now. Right here. But one thing I knew that we could capitalize on is obviously our uh media ability so i was like this this race chase and i've been probably talking about this for the for years the yamaha edit contest we finally figured out through fire Mel how to blast up tens of hundreds of gigs of footage and they actually Ks. let everybody download them without me getting an email saying hey uh you've gone two thousand yeah. dollars over your why, limit yeah why did we give you an account yeah. <laughs> yeah so they're probably thinking that about now but uh since that worked out flawlessly with yamaha edit contest we said let's do the same thing here so for the first two days and uh there's a lot more coming we just haven't had time to do it yet because we're podcasters yeah, yeah. Big, um big and podcast. then we also had to pack uh, a whole bunch of other things but uh <laughs> and we run a go race go tear down all the flags tear down all the banners I had to get a hot tub um, but, uh, we uploaded, I don't know. Um, I shot, it was just me it was crane and I, the first two days, I think, I don't know. I shot a hundred and something minutes of footage that I told Casey and Will to like trim out all the f fluff and they, they thought I meant upload everything. So when they, when you see the string out, that's they yeah. uploaded, they literally didn't trim my clips at all. Oh wow. So just to let you guys well, know, the racing I mean, was so good. I, I skimmed through them. I'm like, dudes, what if I had a bad shot? And, uh, I mean, I don't, they're, hey, they're like, dude, there's not a bad shot in there. there. We go. I mean, hey, here's what I like to say. It's free. You can have a bad shot in there. Just skip it, guys. Well, yeah. the, the thing with less clips is the racing was so good. I right. didn't cut the roll hardly yeah. ever. Yeah. Like, in one of those classes, I think I shot three, what, five-minute-long clips. Yeah. You just following them. Yeah. You couldn't, yeah. You couldn't cut. So I here's the thing. I, I, I knew how to get it to launch chase. How in the world a kid gets it on his phone and what he no, does in there? No idea. That's not my problem. It starts no. with .com. It's called but a the, U problem. Yeah. <laughs> thing is, there's hours of video online for all these kids to yes. download, and there's uh, thousands and thousands of free photos for them also to download. And guess how much money we want for them? Well, I did say free well, already, didn't like I? Like this? this didn't oh, oh, yeah. That's actually, our Vegas money, though. That's our Vegas money, dude. Oh, you're going to have to do one Hey, get, sorry, give me that, bro. Oh, wait. Free oh, wait. No, just burn this up. Hey, uh, speaking free. of, you're probably wondering why we have a stack of 20 Gs right here. Uh, it's not from the race, unfortunately, but it is for <laughs> uh, the Vermoto Dream Stakes. If you're interested in winning a Yamaha Wolverine R Max 2 1000 Sport, two TTR 110s, and this 20 Gs in cash, head over to shopverb.com. For every dollar you spend, you get one entry into the Dream Stakes. Or if you're here at World Mini, you got 10. You ten got times. 10 entries for every dollar that you spend. So Come to who work. knows? Maybe on, uh, I think the contest ends on June 15th. Yep. Is it, it's not a contest. See official rules for details. June 18th. So, June, See rules oh, for details. it's June 18th. So uh, yeah. I think. See official rules for details. There you go. Yep. <laughs> Somewhere around then. I, yeah. Uh, Lori's make us say that because uh, we are idiots and don't yes. actually know the rules of our own thing. Nope. Um, but we are giving away all that to one lucky winner. And uh, maybe it'll be someone here from World Mini. Hopefully. I think I saw the winner. He was a dad with two kids. Oh, yeah. I saw them. I saw yep. them, too. Yeah, yeah. yeah I took no, a, I'm what kidding. It, we, we don't know yet because yeah, we want I know. people to I, buy. I know. I just went ahead and no took winners. a photo anyway. No it, winners yet. Could be Rayson uh, Brixton, Brixton, Rayson Mathis. Brixton, oh, wait, no. Oh, he that's didn't. why he changed his name. No, nope. oh, He wants to win Guess this. what? He didn't buy shit. He came over there asking for free shit. Yeah, he did. He pushed little kids out of the way. I saw it. Yep. Just push yeah, we were like, no way, Jose did. Pulp, get out of here. Yeah. So, um, Crane, I want to know from uh, the vantage point of someone that works with us uh, and, and the ball and chains that you know we have, that oh, yeah. we've now told everybody exist, um, 
how well do we feed you during these weeks? How many breaks do you get? How much water <laughs> oh. and beer are you allowed to have? Okay, we are allowed to have unlimited waters, but we do not take advantage of it whatsoever. Yep. <laughs> this is probably the first time we ever had constant. I mean, we got coolers full of waters, multiple coolers around. First time ever. Ever. Yeah. Ever. I drank. Most I, time we're at Loretta Lynn's, and I'm like, did anybody get waters uh -huh. today? <laughs> well, and typically lunch is another water. Um, <laughs> yeah. Or, or uh, just meat. Meats, meat, meat's always good. A lot of meat. It's always, I, I've had, and then for dinner, I pizza. think only, well, no, we, it's actually, we set a new record. We only had pizza three times. Yep. This and, time. And Coors Lights. And we did not have Panda this time. We did, we did crush. Uh, Dude, why didn't we have Panda? I would have had that. We did have the best <sighs> meal ever was the last night Chipotle. Chipotle, Chipotle was all right. We treated ourselves with Chipotle. Had a big breakfast this morning. I uh, sat in the hot tub. So we were was, supposed to, we were supposed to do this an hour ago, but I texted the boys. I'm like, dudes, I haven't eaten anything but pizza. What and I think turkey and pizza and turkey sandwiches is all I had yes, all yes, week. Pretty much. Yes. Oh, uh, <laughs> so I was like, what do you guys think about going and get some chicken fried steak? As yeah. far as the breaks go there, you know, when you're Zero. filming every single class to get all these kids a free footage, there isn't many breaks, but also it's, the it's racing not many, was so there's, good. there's not any. Yeah, well, it's not seven, any. I, I, honestly, it's seven to midnight pretty much every yeah. day. Yeah. And the race is so good. Seven a.m. Like every seven day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A.m. guys, not P.M. Every time I tried to walk away, I was like, but God, look, they're just battling. Oh, and so I had to go yeah, back. And and it was funny. I actually walked into the restaurant today. I was asking you guys, I'm like, we're just smoked and we work till midnight. Night. Now we used to work to midnight because we weren't nearly as efficient. We become so efficient that we feel like feel like we got to film everything, yeah, do more, edit everything, do more. do more and more and more. So we have to work till midnight. Uh, but what's different now than it used to be is Lake Whitney 2009. We we probably filmed like seven classes a day. Yeah. We would pick them out, go hammer those classes, and go do interviews with those kids, and then come back and have plenty of time yeah. to turn it around. Now I feel like, especially with our own events, I, I like I was telling you guys, I feel this weight on my shoulders yep. to literally film every freaking class. I do class. too, man. I do too. To the like, point that we're work, walking 30,000 steps a day. Yeah. yeah. Um, 31,000 steps on Wednesday, But that guys. was another reason we wanted to <laughs> upload all this footage because so much of it never sees the light of day. Never. And I'm like, you know what? At least if we upload it, the women's class might not make the highlight reel or whatever, but Sophia Phelps and Brookie Whipple could at least get in there and yeah. download we all the damn you. clips. We filmed you. You figure out how to do it with the rest of it, but uh, that was definitely the problem that I had the epiphany walking into the restaurant. It's like, we only used to film a handful of classes a day, and now yeah. we film every single damn one. Yeah. Yeah, it, uh... But to talk to a kid, and when they're like, oh man, you didn't get me, and I've heard it before, it just crushes me. It crushes yeah. me, because I've shot, especially when I shot there all day long with the intent to get every kid, and you miss one. Yeah. So this weekend, we kind of made a conscious decision, like, there's no, no room for that. Every no room. Kid, every I want, kid I want a here photo. I did say that, didn't I? I want yeah. a photo of every kid. Yeah, and I, and guess what? Every kid got. It, I'm I'm calling it at least six. Yeah, that's killer. I'm calling dude. it. Props, bro. No, we uh like the army. No man it, left behind. I started the, uh, shooting photos at, uh, at the beginning of the event. Crane took over. <laughs> we had Parker Stevens come in on Friday. We gave Parker that same mission. He shot 11,000 photos. Oh, 11,000 wow. photos in Good a job, day. Good job, Parker. And for reference, I think Crane and I probably do like 3,000 a day. Yeah. Um, he, he took his job seriously. He had 6,000 by lunch. Um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so the, the uh, good news is there's a lot of free photos that we put up. Uh, there's now there's 11,000 yeah. more that we didn't get to. Uh, we'll probably scale that down to say two. Yeah. Um, but there's a lot more to come once we get back to Idaho and actually uh -huh. have time to uh, to finish well, all well, this stuff. Well, the problem is, is uh, so obviously we, we have we do have a Starlink. Thank you, Elon. Yeah, Elon. Uh, but with all the stuff we are uploading, it took <laughs> us uh, an entire day yesterday to get Crane's gallery was from Saturday. Yeah, the on the web. An entire that's why, day. That's yeah. why I called it part one. I didn't say Saturday because yes. people are going to be like, even, you guys are lazy. I'll tell you yeah. what, we even took it home to real internet. And it, it still, still didn't upload because <laughs> we <laughs> fell asleep because it was midnight. <laughs> yeah. So, sorry, guys. And you we'll acted like you worked to midnight all the other days before that. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, guys. We'll and, get, we'll and get then there, the day promise. that you drove down here, you, yeah. did you drive to midnight? Oh, uh, no, oh, no. oh, wait. Uh, yeah. I did. You yeah. know, I don't yeah. drive. <laughs> you know, I don't drive, dog. <laughs> oh, wait, did you watch me drive to midnight? Yes, I did watch you drive to midnight. Hey, I stayed up the <laughs> entire time. You did. A lot better than last year. If you want to watch a funny video, go watch the drive to World Do not go watch that video. 2023. Do not go watch it. amazing. Do not go watch it. We did stop and snowboard on the way down here last year. It was amazing. I mean, Wes was not, but I maybe had a few. All right, I think few, it's time, guys. Oh, uh, what for time for what? Oh, I don't know. I just I've never had this button before. It's and a I good just song. Really like it. it made me happy. It's a good we'll talk song. Talk about the drive. Oh yeah, the drive. Yeah. Well, hey, talk. Uh, all right. Well, glad we're not making it because we're going to plop. Crane is driving. So yeah, I am awesome. driving. Uh, well, talking about driving, uh, I want to get to standouts, but. The biggest standouts to me are my East Coast crew that came in wow. 
freaking Swift, my boy Jason Baker, Stacy Baker, I called them a few weeks back and I said, hey, what would it take for you guys to support World Mini? And they literally just said, we're there. And Amazing. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they had a qual uh, Loretta Lynn qualifier in uh, Louisiana and their logic was they were already 14 hours into yeah. a 40 hour drive. Why not? I just go drive 26 more. Drive 26 more. What's another, what's another day on the road? So they convinced <laughs> Taste Morgan and Wyatt Duff to come out here, which I thought was really damn cool. And back in the day, World Mini, everybody did do that yep. trick. I yep. remember like Brent Jernigan and Rick Grant Ransdell running out of gas on the way out here when I was flying and they were supposed to pick me up. And uh, anyways, Tons of people used to make this trek. Hopefully, we will start convincing them even more. But a yeah. uh, huge shout-out to them for making the uh, w making the trek. Jace Baker got a third in awesome. Schoolboy 1, which I was stoked on. Wyatt Duff got, let's see, two championships. Taste got one. And then Taste got one. So East, Boys, well, East Coast Taste boys are good. Taste actually got two because he rode uh, the, the pit bike race. Yes, the yes, he uh, did. Demolished right. everybody. everybody. Everybody on Surons, everything. They were cutting the track, and he was still beating them. That's crazy. Yeah. And he, didn't eat, he had like a cutoff. Like the kids just – Rips, he's yeah. cool little. He's kid, also the man. perfect size of that well, it, too, though. Yeah. So it's funny we decided to do this East versus West uh, ver video that I talked about, and uh, I don't really even know Nolan Ford or uh, Dan and Reed, some of the West Coast kids that are out here. Gage Dunham, I went up there. I know Wyatt. I know Jace. I know Tace, and I'm up there just egging on this like <laughs> yeah. rivalry. Tupac and I, Biggie. Yeah, I was like yep. straight up like, Yo, Nolan, I'm East Coast too. Uh, you suck, bro. <laughs> yeah. You know who's yep. gonna smoke you, White Duff. Nice. And then, but that was for me to get the quotes out of Duff. And then I went uh, over and I'm like, "Yo, no one, yo, no one, you're gonna, you're gonna smoke him." You know, whatever. Well, the, the thing is, bro, how we've been around. You can tell we've all been around Brent for five days. Here's mm -hmm. the thing. Here's the thing. Uh, Here's the thing. Uh, we yep. we are East Coast. We are East Coasters, but. But we're West Coasters because now we live in Idaho. We're both. We're allowed to be on both sides. We're both. We're yeah. Tupac and Biggie. We are Tupac and Boom. Biggie. I grew up in the center, so I'm right between Yeah, you're, you're not. You're if not I knew like, rap music at all, I'd make a reference like of Nelly. what rapper I am. You're like Nelly. <laughs> I am Nelly. You're Nelly. Yep. We are uh, like I can tell you who I'm not. I can tell you who I'm not. Puff Daddy. Not Puff nah, Daddy. Nah, not Puff Daddy. Nah, <laughs> Puff Daddy. No Puff that's over my, here. That's baby. my only rap reference. No <laughs> Puff over here, guys. No Puff Puff. <laughs> Uh, all right, so standouts, boys. Uh, give me an Ashen song, not the love making song, especially after the uh, <laughs> the God tough reference. Uh, right. I don't know, God, dude. All right, standout to World Mini. Give me the song, dude. God, demerit. I, I don't know. Do demerit, boys. Have the Ashen song. Let's try it. There it is. Oh, demerit, okay. boys. Okay, back. I thought you were talking about that. So all right, standouts demerit. from World Mini. Uh, I'm gonna start. You start because I want zero racing. Oh yeah, Chase did watch zero racing. <laughs> he he, racing. Time. One he photo. probably might not be able to weigh in on this at all. Weighing in zero, I'm out. All right, Jaden, Jaden Smart, number four, Wait, on, what, on a Cobra. Oh, and he Ricky moved Carmichael. up to uh, Yamaha 85 in the younger 85 divisions. This, my man, took home four championships. Unreal. And I think he took home like four last year too. Yeah, yeah. The, they kid, must, the kid has like nine of those trophies. His dad's like, "Hey, man, I love you guys." They're not coming to World Mini but, anymore. But we're not coming that. anymore. <laughs> I got seven of these trophies, dude. But, but speaking of trophies, it's really cool. Uh, we do have four foot, five feet tall first yep. place trophies, whatever they are. They're they pretty yep. much even. Jace Baker, uh, his third place trophy was pretty much as yep. tall as him, yep. and he's a uh, you know twelve year old. A larger. Kids are digging. He's it. a fifteen year old, but uh, uh, you know. 15. Super mini rider that you know yeah. comes up to here on me. Yeah, yeah. To, um, to watch people try and shove them in their moto vans at the uh, end, like they had to repack. You yeah, know, to they, get their trophies yes, in. Absolutely. Watching the kids try to carry them. Amazing on the pit um, bikes and everything. Oh yeah. So but, I, I love I love that we're uh, staying staying with that. Uh, when we got the naming rights back from Ron Hendrickson, yeah. R.I.P. He did pass away yeah. uh, just this past year. Uh, we did. He, he signed us over the naming rights to World Mini Grand Prix, which is the longest running yep. amateur event yep. uh, in the history of amateur racing. Yep. 1972 Indian Dunes. Uh, this was the 45th official running of this event. But anyways, one promise we made to him that we wouldn't go with the cheapo plaques. He said, I want to keep my big trophies. And we said, yes, sir. Yep. And we said, yes, we did sir. Too. We, did. I got we, a, did too. we did. too. I got a quick Jaden Smart story. Just real quick. Okay. So his brother, his little brother. Okay. He's a little, little, little hustler. I like him. He's yep. funny. Okay. Coming over, trying to get us, get all these free t-shirts. And I was like, hey, man. And he asked for like one and he came back again. And I was like, look. I want a jersey. I was like, but you got to go get it. You yeah. have to get it off his back. Yeah. So Jaden gets on the podium. I think it was his last win, last yep. championship. I was like, hey, man, you got to get over there to get that jersey. I want that jersey. Yep. So he goes and gets the jersey, come back. Jaden signs it, and we are bringing it to Plup tonight to nice. put in the studio. Nice. We are going to make this new amateur. Yeah. 
if Jaden might be his new guy. He has to. He has, he's Stop. number four. He's basically Ricky Carmichael. I got two Jaden stories. I was at his rig. When he was getting the jersey out for you. <laughs> you were not. And they gave it to me to go give back to you guys to give to Steve. Oh. And I said, I'll go give this to you guys to get to Steve as long as all of us forever guys get one. So at Loretta Lynn's this year, <laughs> we're all getting James uh, Smart. I, that's funny. I had, I'd had already walked up. I had worked out on the podium with his mom, Jocelyn. I said, <laughs> yep. she said, you can't have that one because they're new ones. Uh, and yep. I only have three of them. And I said, I don't care. I just, I'll take that's one. She's gonna hook us so up. it's funny. We all said we would. Smart I mean, Jay, so not a. Do we actually want wait, to hand? Wait, we can't give him. St- no, that, we can't, we can't give, give him to Steve. No, He's no, our no, guy. He's our guy. Did yeah, we no, just no, figure no. this out? No, He's our Steve guy. does not get him. I'll tell you another thing about Jaden Smart. So the kid may win a lot, which he does win a lot, and he's on the 80s, so he's moving up. Yep. This kid has so much heart. Last year, he won our free Stacy giveaway, which is so cool. And one of his buddies comes up and goes, "Man, you get you always win. You're so lucky." And he goes, "What are you talking about?" He goes, "You won every you, uh, you won every moto." He goes, "That's not luck. I earned those." Oh, that's our guy. I won that's the Stacy. Steve, you do not and get Jaden Smart. He was how old when he said that? So I told his mom that, and his mom had never. She goes, "Oh my god!" I gave him a big old hug. <laughs> hey, it was so cool. I, I, hey, just delete everything I said. That jersey's for. Our studio. Hey, this what, is our we're, we're gonna just say Steve to anybody. We're gonna taunt Steve. Can with we it? write two verb and still give it to Steve? No, we are gonna <laughs> we're gonna taunt Steve with it. I might yeah. try to wear it tonight. I might. I just wear it. I would love to I see you in Jaden yeah. Sports jersey. Should we go ahead and get another one sent out? Yeah, yeah. That one breaks. Hey, Jocelyn, we're gonna need one in like if you guys are driving through Vegas, just drop one off at Steve's. So yeah, uh, there you go. Jaden Smart, big amateur standout. Who's Amazing. Who's other ones? Four championships, like we said. So uh, the most, the most out of anyone. Most, if if we those, had King of the West, uh, like we do with King of the Classic. Yep. And those Jane classes Smart probably would have won. Deep. They were yeah, deep. They oh were yeah, deep. I mean, I guess that's a good thing to point the out. Deepest class. Our sixty-five classes were pretty much full gates. Uh, we had a couple other full gates, but all these wow, sixty-five yep. classes were packed to the gills. Hey. When people say, man, man, people just don't amateur motocross it. No, it's That's there. the next generation. It's here, bro. It's yeah. here. We had 65, 60, 50s was packed. Like, the, the, there's it's a coming. lot of people still racing is what I'm saying. Yeah. It's that, and that's why we're going to keep Jaden for ourselves. Yeah. Yes. Jaden's yeah. ours. All right. Suck it, Steve. The green jersey, right? Suck it, Steve. Yep, that's ours. All right. Next up, Crane. Um, give me another song. Like That that hype is like how I like that. All righty. We're, we're going to go. Up there. All right. All right. Next up. On the standout list, we got Mr. Jet Rao with three championships. Well, you got to give him the classes. You got to give what, what classes. Oh, gosh. Um, <laughs> Let me read this. All right, we got 65, 79 goes to Jet Rao, and I didn't write all the freaking extra little things. Yeah, with yeah. The the yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically one, yeah. Uh, yeah seven and we one. got 51, 7 to 8 limited Jet Rao and 51, Jet 4 Rao. to 8 limited Jet Rao. What's kind? So um, another cool thing about World Mini is it's not AMA. It is NMA, which is another promise we uh, made to Ron. Apparently, yep. uh, well, not apparently. Not we, apparently. This, this is a pretty <laughs> no, well-known thing. NMA and AMA. Uh, we're pretty not much, friends. They not were friends. never friends. And, uh, and uh, he definitely said, I, I don't ever. Yeah, we ain't getting you AMA. You never yeah, no, AMA. AMA. He, he, he gave us a, a time limit that he wanted to be uh, NMA. Yep. Um, but we told him eventually it probably uh, yeah. would need to conform. But again, <laughs> it's back, a, you know, NFC, AFC came back, together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Back, back to the promises that you make uh, someone to Correct. carry on a legacy. So anyways, our, our class structure here is very different. And um, even back to, uh, you know, just talking about Jaden there, there's a lot of classes that he was able to ride in the age brackets from – 9 to 12, nine to, to freaking 15. 9 to 15, yep. 12, 14, 13, 15. There's a lot of different places these kids can race. And uh, what was cool about it, though, is it brought me back to World Mini 04, Pocket City 04. You'd be able to see Eli, Eli Tomac race Ian Treadle, who were five, six years yeah. apart. It was the only time you ever got to see That's those cool. dudes together. So when I go back and watch that video, I'm like, these dudes didn't um, race each other all the time. Yeah. yeah. And they went at NMA events. Uh, despite their their age gap, so it was cool here to see a really young dude race uh, the, the the older end of the yeah. pack too. So, yeah. so anyway, the the uniqueness of the class structure, I'm actually super duper into. AMA will never adapt this, but no. uh, I you know what? It, it's fun to be NMA NMA uh, as verb a, 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 a verb a, something yeah, so, like that. So Jet Rao, so speaking of trophies and Jet Rao, yep. so I go over there to shoot him, and he's only got one first place trophy. And I was yep. like, kid, didn't you win everything? He goes, no. I gave my trophies, my other ones, oh. to, to a couple of friends of mine. Who oh, know. What a good wow. So he gave one to one of his sponsors and one to one of oh, his buddies. That's awesome. Wow. Man. Yeah, and good, that, you. good for you, that, Jet that kid is so. That's per, per, don't we actually have something that Shaw talks about how good their family is? Yeah. Oh, very, yeah. very wholesome family. We've uh, shot a documentary like two years ago with Garrett, them. Garrett we Paul. followed them uh, 2022 all the way from their aerial qualifier all the way through yeah. Loretta Lynn's. Uh, our man, Garrett Pohl. Um, it's, it's like 98% done. It's like 97, I think. And every couple months. and. 
in Garrett's defense, he just did have his second, second kid. kid. He, has, he does have a full time job. He has yeah. a full time job, but every couple months, Garrett will text me like, "Hey, man, let's uh, let's talk about coalescence." And I'm like, "Yeah, dude, hit me up whenever you got time." Either and way, then, the last the last cut I saw it made me cry, and I remember good. actually filming this moment at Loretta Lynn's. Uh, Jet had almost won. Oh, shit, it's so long at this point. Know. Yeah, but his dad, his dad and mom quarter. are actually such good people. Like. You see so many 50 parents yelling at their kids like, God dang, I spent all my life saving doing this. Yeah. And even now, there were some parents at the Verb Classic last year almost wanted to kick out. <laughs> and yep. if it weren't for the kid being a kid, I yeah. would have said, get the hell out of here. <laughs> um, they're the most wholesome family I've yeah. literally ever seen. Good people. I remember the Jet was crying. He was the one freaking out. And his dad was like, it's okay, dude. You, you put your yep. heart and soul into this. To yep. Do the best you can. And that's what matters. And I remember like I'm filming it and I'm like, yeah, yeah like because I was a newly minted dad of that my, myself yeah. at that point, and uh, I was <laughs> like, man, I, I hope man. that's the kind of dad I can. Be. Right. <laughs> Pulls so, your anyways, uh, from from three championships to his parents, uh, I, yeah. he they're, they're standouts across yep. the board. Amazing people. Amazing and his mom family. is fast. His mom is oh, way yeah, faster on a dirt bike than I would ever be. Hey, da their dad's fast too. Oh, oh no. that was the they reason. They all made Loretta. That's Loretta's. why we picked them. Yes, they all made Loretta's. They all three made Loretta's yeah. in the yeah. same year. They're the only family to have. Yeah, story, all three of them storyboarded this whole thing for Gary. That's right. Yeah, I'm glad I, we remember this. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, so, anyways, maybe, maybe we'll, we release it. Maybe we release maybe it. Maybe we release it. Garrett, if you're listening, which I know you are, uh, hit me up, dog. Yeah, get this out. Yep, yep. All right, another three championships in the A classes. Swept all three A classes. Uh, okay, you're gonna get a good song. All right, good song. New, it's a new one. It is. Oh, it's a new one. Nice. Yeah, it's a new we, one. We have the option of three songs is on this, this soundboard. The, is, this the, is this the plop one? <laughs> no, this is the artist. This is ours. Oh, this is ours. ours. I'm tired, guys. I don't know. Uh, all right. Three championships tying himself with Jet Rao. We got Preston Kilroy. Yeah. Yeah, number 77 Preston. on the Yamaha. Dude. Open A. a AMA 250A, 450A. National number. Number yep. 77. Yeah. Number, earned. Number, earned. And you know what? Uh, uh, Marshall Welton came yesterday. Sunday. Troy Dog Squad. Troy Dog Squad. He tried to in uh, Open A dethrone Preston, he, and Preston he said did. he did win a moto. He, took he did win a moto. moto. That second Last moto, lap. Preston said. Later. Uh -uh. Okay, I lied. Uh -uh. I I did sneak out of the booth and watch a couple races. Whoa, and whoa, that whoa. was one of the races. Yeah, they good. did they did unlock the chain and ball from the t shirts. Chase vendor. leaving the booth. Yeah. You have the key. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> sometimes me and Brent were switching off on the keys. So <laughs> anyways. It, I watched those two, dude. It was a good great battle, race, dude. good battle. I can't believe how fast uh, those Preston are. is, and I mean both of them. But like Preston, like this track got rough as shit. Yeah, yeah. It did. and Preston, I could not. Like, I, dude, it's just watching a pro damn rider. Oh, yeah, dude, seeing how right. they can navigate a track like this and just act like it's I, effortless is crazy. I just think it's cool. A couple, like literally, these dudes race AMA Supercross, Motocross. Yeah. Like they came and raced this. Like that just tells me like it's so crazy that like the moto mentality of like. I don't have anything to do this weekend off of Supercross. I'll just go race yeah. this gnarly ass track. I talked to Marshall Welton and he goes, dude, he's like, I love World of Man. He goes, it was so cool to come no back. Shit. And, and he saw the footage too that we posted from really? the shot from the DVX and yep. he thought that was super badass. Wow. Yeah. You can check that out on the Grom Report day two. Yeah. <laughs> I did bring out the DVX 100B, which I shot with uh, out here in 2007. Yep. I shot half a day with it uh, and it's pretty cool. Yeah. So anyways, cool that they came out and supported the event. Thank you guys. They took on some cash. Oh, isn't, yeah. it, isn't it crazy, though, like as fast as they are? You would think you could not uh, go faster can, on I told track. my brother that the other yes. day. I literally said that to and him watching somehow this. there's faster people. Somehow, I, literally sitting there watching the moto, and I'm like, you know you what's insane is? I don't think you can go faster on a dirt bike. And then you got like uh, Jorge Prado and Jeffrey Hurlings and Eli, Eli Tomac, Tomac yeah. and Cooper Webb. And, and I'm like, Jet Lawrence and Hunter. Like, how I do can. you go faster? It's insane. How do you go faster on a dirt bike? I don't know. Well, no, I'm asking the question. Oh, I, I don't, don't know. know. What I'm just, it is cool to see guys like Preston go that speed here because we don't always see that like in the, in the trains, like the nationals. Yeah. Right. When there is those jets. Because, so, because you, yeah. like, it, this is, I, does, I hope this does not sound bad. Like, when you're watching them in a pro national, you're watching guys faster. Absolutely. So you're like, oh, like, he doesn't look like he's going that fast, right? But he... Then you see him out here, and you're, you're like, like, oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> he is so he's fast on a dirt seen. bike, dude. He's a fa I, I, I saw fastest Preston. guy I've ever seen we, at World Mini in 2024. Yes, we saw Preston <laughs> in, uh, at Muddy Creek, too, and I was like, you can't go faster You cannot go faster on go, a dirt but, bike. But people can. We were adding up the <laughs> amount of uh, purse money that Preston has taken away from us uh, in the past, uh, the past year. <laughs> what a dick. Good for him. Thanks, Good for Preston. Him. Yeah, congrats, Preston. Dick, taking all our money. All right, we got we got so we got a lot of ties for uh, two championships. Let's just, let's just rip them all off. Rip the band aid. Um, oh, hang on, we gotta get a song. 
Yeah, sure. Hey, hey mention the new just one. Mention the uh, you don't have to mention <laughs> classes, but like I have super yeah. mates. Some of these people don't know who Sue and Um Nolan Ford, he's a Loretta Lynch champion this past year. He's got a great uh, T- TJ, uh, who used to work for uh, Max Volan. Uh, Max Volan, yeah, TJ's working hard. I, I, was, I said Nolan must be riding those bikes hard the and TJ's building them. Is he the one with the No, that's mullet? tough. That's tough. Yeah. But, but what is confusing about them is uh, Nolan's 44. 44. Duff is 444. Four, 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 and four. another champion that we have, uh, Danan Reed. He's 44. also 44. Yes, that's why I was like, I'm watching all these videos, and I'm like, who are these? We had kids? a lot of fours here. This if you week. had a four on your bike, you need to check for a moto. Jaden Smart, number, number four. four. Yeah, like what's uh, everybody? Kiefer, to be 47. Michael? Levi yeah. Kitchen was here. Yeah, uh, Aiden yeah. Kiefer was here. Yeah. yeah, shout out to the Kiefer's. Go listen to the. They have a wrap up of their own on the. Uh, yeah, only listen to it if they say. Good yeah, yeah, we don't so. know. We haven't listened to it yet. So if they start saying bad things, just shut yeah, it off. Yeah. Don't listen to it anymore. Um. So, anyways, it was really cool to see him out there. And I, even though he'd won Loretta's, I was pretty unfamiliar with him. Yeah. And now I've talked to him so much. Like, no one Ford. Okay, the, so. the mullet, right? No. 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 Damn it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm going to stop talking. White Duff did also get two championships featured in the East versus West. He's video, got the mullet. But he's 4 4 and he's the mullet. Yeah. Guy. He's, he's from Kentucky. Kentucky's got he the mullet. Has, of course he's got a mullet. He wrote on IG mullet powers. Mullet boy. Yes, he did. Oh, one guy we have to mention Dozer. We, we got to mention. Well, hang on. Let, okay, let me finish, too. We'll get, we'll get back to those. I thought you were done. I thought you were done. Nope. Then we got Riley Bruff. Ru- oh. Riley Bruff. Okay. Riley Bruff, uh, the track owner's son. Do we do we, do, do we get into this right now? Like, sure. Go, okay. Riley Bra, all the bras, McCoy Bra, Gav Bra, all road. Those dudes were out on that There's track. three of them. Three of them. They They're, all do all the track maintenance out here with their dad. They all the track maintenance. And? They take a quick little break. To go race. Go win motos over Chris Kiefer. <laughs> and like all these other fast dudes in and the like, pro classes in the pro classes and then they go back to work it was we're tearing down the tent and watering at 3 a.m 7 o'clock and they're still doing stuff and i was like oh cool what's you like go get a break he's like uh no nah, we leave it like uh two in the morning to go to preston idaho for our next uh event. R- riley had to cut his podium in a very short and go put more oh, water and, on the track and, like for real and he has <laughs> two very small children Wow, and his wife's just hustling over at the, like, the sign Talk tower about too. a talk about a moto family. The bras are moto fa- bro. You know, I'm, I might Sorry. figure out what the speeds like, what it's like racing next year. You know, I'm gonna have to break out my, <laughs> bring, my, my hey, 2024 bike of the year. Brixton and um, Aubrey Navy, and Navy, yep. and Aubrey and Navy too, and run the booth and all the photos, and then do 30 minute motos. I don't have enough to do it. These can things, we, maybe I'll try it. Can out. we yeah. all try to do? Yeah, a we bra? all got time. We all can got we, time. Can we all try to do a bra marathon and just like die after? Yeah, like, I honestly don't. Iron bra. I don't know. The iron bra. That's the iron bra <laughs> coming iron up. Bra all right, so, anyways, that's, and, that's uh, the last say. person tied with two championships, Grayson Townsend, came out last year oh, on yeah, the 80s. I think he took four or five home last year. Yep. He got two this year. He moved up to big bikes. Team Green Rider. Fast as shit. He also was, works on the track. Also, by the way. No, uh, his brother does. So, so, uh, we, we got a little beef with his brother. A little beef. Uh-oh. A little beef. He helped us a lot this week, right? Uh-huh. Tearing down flags, setting up. What did Gunner do? Man. Yesterday, Gunner's uh, dropped off some flags. Yeah, he's backing up. Ran over our uh, very uh, expensive. One, one of a kind. One of a kind with verb logos, everything. Uh, I knew where you were going boards. with this. I Cornhole knew where you were going with this. I was very angry with Gunner. Gunner owes us some money. That's what I'm saying. Need some of those Is guys. he old enough to buy, buy us a Coors Light pack? I mean, I don't know. I Actually, no his dad did give us a Coors Light. Oh, his dad did. Ah, okay, we're even. We're even. We'll let we'll him off. We'll let you off, Gunner, this time. We got yeah. new I got a special shout out for a third place rider. Okay, okay, third place rider. Jackson Lee in one of the 50 classes. I came, I was walking by and he is hugging his trophy. Oh, no way. And I and I, I run over, he's hugging, and he gives the world mini logo a kiss and I, I run oh. over there. And so last year they came all the way from uh, uh, Texas. Wow. And they came up and he took fourth and he goes, no. I want one of those trophies. I want one so bad. So you know that's all he They weren't going to come back this year because it's, it's, a, it's a hug. Yeah, it's a hug. Grayson's expensive. He's on 50 class. And he goes, I'm going to get one of those third places. Wow. Mom and dad oh, couldn't wow. make it, couldn't get off work. No. Grandparents came and took him. No. And he got third. I got chills. And he got That's third. Cool. I got chills. That's cool. And there's, there's a benefit to walking around the pits and this and seeing the, the trophies sitting outside the motorhomes. It's yeah. the coolest thing. I got a, one more cool story. And I, I don't remember the dad's name, the rider's name. There's a lot of people you meet at these events. The kid came over and was like, hey, man, y'all selling Scott goggles. And I was like, no, but like, hey, we got... Uh, Scott gave us a bunch of free pairs to give out to kids. And, yep. 
and I, I threw him a pair of goggles, and the kid was very appreciative. Thank you, you know, blah, blah, blah. Dakota Lee, not Jackson Lee, Dakota Lee for me. Okay. Sorry. So anyways. Sorry, uh, sorry, not Jackson, Dakota, Dakota Lee. Dakota Lee. Dakota Lee. <laughs> so anyways, I'm, I'm sitting there, we're kind of tearing, you know, we're at the booth, whatever, and the dad walks up to me, and he goes, man, thank you so much, man. And I'm like, oh, dude, yeah, no problem, man. Like, big, no big deal. He goes, I can't remember the whole story. He crashed or something. He was like, dude, he got fourth, and he was so bummed out because he wanted a trophy. Yeah. Like, and he was like, him getting that pair of goggles, like, just turned his day No around. way. Yeah, I swear to God. That's I, so cool. And I'm sorry if I don't remember the dude's name. It, like I said, it's, so there's a lot going on at these events. Chase doesn't remember my name. No, least. apparently. Apparently. It's like, <laughs> it's a long Leslie. Week. <laughs> and, uh, but anyway, so shout out to that dad. Because, like, to me, that's why we give these things out is yep. because for people like that, like, that dad, yeah. it, I think he came back over again and was like, hey, man, wow. before we leave, just wanted to thank you again. I'm like, bro, it's a, it's a pair of goggles, <laughs> you man. Know, uh, like, so another giveaway story yesterday. I, I didn't help you guys really set up the booth all week. I came down yeah, here yeah. to lock the shackles on the boys. Yeah, yeah. Did. Yesterday I got here so early because I want to do a B-roll mission in the morning, but it was Brent and I up there, and this uh, dad comes up, and he's like, man, my – my son's gloves are just shredded because there's so much track time here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's like, are you guys selling gloves? And we're like, uh, no, but Fist Gloves supports us. Yep. And we had a handful of pairs that we hadn't given away yet. Uh, they didn't have his size. Uh, and, and Brent was wearing some to set up the tents. Yeah. And Brent's like, well, I, you want these? You could take these, and he's like, "Are you for real?" No. I, and the dad was just so hyped that he got this no. fist pair of gloves that Brent been hey, using. Hey, those gloves stuff. hammered in tens of Bro, stakes over the weekend. T- t- tens of thousands hey. of stakes over the past two hey, years. Hey, yeah. hey, thank you, Fist. Yes. They not only do they sponsor our free hot dogs, they which is save our hands, which is ten thousand hot dogs and, and, across and the course of the year. And I tell this story every time. So Fist is an Australian company. We're like, who could we? Because we had that. We were giving away free hot dogs. I'm like, who could we get to sponsor this? We we gave it to Fist. And they, dude, within probably minutes, seconds even, Lords, we are all in. That sounds amazing. We'll send you gloves. We'll send you all this stuff. Fist full of hot dogs. Fist, fist full, full of hot, hot dogs. dogs. The fist dudes, some of the coolest dudes. In the, so go buy some fist gloves, yep. man. Seriously. Well, With your twenty dollars off of Motorsport, oh, God, yeah. I am a company man. Everybody that comes to Verb Shred Tour events, you get twenty dollars off Motorsport.com. And you know what, Chase? I'm just going to read off this code. If you're listening right oh, now, free the, fir- the first person that uses this code gets twenty dollars off at Motorsport.com. It's nine three six nine B two three four three C. That's nine three six nine Bravo two three four three Charlie. Hey, you know what, Wes? If they didn't win that one, try this one. Well, you want to try this one? D as in donkey seven <laughs> okay we're gonna start that over d as in donkey <laughs> d as in donkey okay seven as in donkey <laughs> okay let's try to get these people the code man hey you guys got d7 i'm so not far? gonna be able to talk for plop tonight you guys got dude. d7 i'm not gonna be able to talk for plop all right d donkey 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 lava all right d seven three eight Delirious. All right. Donkey. Uh, uh, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to restart this once more time. If you are still listening, if you are still listening, you are gonna get a donkey code to motosport.com. <laughs> donkey code. It is D seven three eight three four eight three zero zero. I have no idea if I said all of that stuff right. I'm very tired, I can barely see, but here it is if oh you're watching gosh. on YouTube. Donkey code. Delirious donkey. Thank you, Ryan. Hey, thank you, Ryan, to Motosport for coming out. One of the coolest dudes. We hung out. He hung out with us all weekend. JJ from Gringer yep. hung out with us all weekend. And honestly, I was telling them, I was like, usually it's just me under this booth by myself for eight hours a day, and I wanted to shoot myself. So thank <laughs> you for uh, hanging out with me all weekend and, and having a good if time. You're, if you're going to bring up the Gringers, I have to tell you the most fun I had all week. Uh, like <laughs> I'm the riding back and forth. The, the track riding is a quarter mile from here, and you have to kind of ride on the yeah, part of the yeah, GT500 course. Yeah, and you just rip the Gringers G3. And I've had them since the Gypsy 500, and I've rode around my neighborhood with my wife and yeah, kids yeah. a little bit. But I haven't really like yeah, taken yeah, them out them and up. like yeah, and opened them up. And I was like riding on the course. I'm like, I should probably wear a helmet Bro, right now. Man. But it's so much fun. Man. I I was like, it's what my turn mean? to run down Wait, there. What do you mean you weren't wearing helmets? We were all wearing helmets. You should have worn a, a, a better yes. helmet. Please wear helmets um, on your Gringer G3s. Gunner and I were coming, and I was hauling down the road. I was going way faster on the uh, Gringer than I was when I actually rode the Gypsy 500 course yeah. by far. Yeah, so I was rolled. <laughs> And uh, Gunner comes around the side by side of the corner, and he doesn't hear me coming. Oh my God! And both of our eyes through our helmets, you could see both of our eyes no. were so big. I go right, he goes right. I gave him the honk, for the, the the verbal honk, because you can't honk. 
Um, and then we kept going. But yeah, wow. fun, fun, fun times. Wow. Yeah. E- either way, I can't. I'm, I'm really excited. I, I want to become like a pit bike dude again with that Gringer G3. Oh, it, man. And, and I, especially they want, after watching Chase Morgan riding they, it. They it's, quit it's giving sick. away. Uh, so uh, Faster Minis was giving away, like, I, I can't remember, 100 bucks for whole shots. Yeah. They literally had to put the Gringers on the second row because they're like, Gringers are getting every whole shot. Yes. Yep. So yep. shout out, JJ. And I, I, I did think it was funny in the stock pit bike class, all the 110s were like, we don't want to race against the Gringers. I was like, why? And now uh, I know why. And now I know why. Uh, you know why. I seriously the think the, bo- fast. the bottom end on the Gringer G3s oh, it's are, is that, equi- it's it, equivalent to the uh, the Surons, I'm pretty is. sure. And it's having insane. the back brake on it, too, it just makes you feel uh, like you're on a, like, yeah. back on a real Dude, motorcycle. Those bikes, uh, honestly, JJ, thank you, because honestly, they saved me from... Uh, 40,000 more steps. 40,000 more steps yeah. and uh, a couple like uh, bathroom things that needed to happen. <laughs> Absolutely. You know? I mean, you didn't want to use the porter potty. That's so thank awesome. you, JJ. All right, moving into other standouts. <laughs> <laughs> no, more standouts? Uh, not more. Uh, well, yeah, let's, let's just, uh, just you know, if we, we run off some I'm going to run off some, uh, just let's all get, the rest of the champions here because I think it's important that everybody hears their name since we took 4,000 photos of them. Yeah. Uploaded all these free videos. If you love all that, by the way, head over to shopverb.com. You guys supporting us is how we support you. For real. So, uh, and as we mentioned at the top of the show, by supporting us, you could also win a Yamaha side by side, two TTR one tens of twenty thousand dollars in cash. And the way you do that is shopverb.com. So not only support us, see official rules for details. See official rules for details. Not only are you supporting us, but you could one lucky person is going to win all that. And I think this week or next two weeks, we're giving away Michelin Star Cross six tires. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Someone, anybody? Thank you, Randy. From the start of the March eighth to now, if you bought anything, someone, someone's going to win. Someone's going to win. I think it goes to the martyr. I don't even know when it goes through, so I'm not going to say anything right now. Yep. No percent. See official rules for details all right give me some music crane so i can actually get yeah into yeah this. Let's just read, read off the list of champs Alrighty, real quick and we're going back see to how fast it. you can do it no I, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm, I, I'm not gonna do it that fast all right in the girls 65 class we got leighton dalbert women 85 to super mini kinsley jackman women 12 plus sophia phelps the 125 cc class cohen jackman college boy cameron horner 125C, Sean Sutton, 250C, Alicio Chavez. Chavez. And he actually got two championships. I'm sorry, and you got had two. the sickest pit bike. Alicio, we should have mentioned that. I did write you got two championships, and I forgot to put you on my two championships page. I profusely apologize to you, but epic work in the 250C class there. 450C champion is Chase O'Hare. 250B, we got Chase Haynes. 450B, Alvin Hillian. Wow, this list is a lot longer it's than long. I thought. It's long. 54 to 6, Julian Arm. Allmogger. Sorry, Al- sorry. Allmogger. Sorry, whatever you're. Uh, sorry. Julian. Sorry, uh, Julian. Next Julian. time I see Al- Alma Alma Guerre. Let me, let me see. Alma Guerre. Alma Guerre. Oh, uh, Julian. Good job, Julian. Julian. Yeah. Yeah. E by class, we got Ethan Fisher. Ethan. 51 4 to 6 limited, Ezra Arm Bruster. 51 5 to 7 limited. Luke Witt. Wow. And I'm pretty uh and then Super Mini One, I mentioned him earlier, but Dan and Reed. Uh and if you want to watch a GoPro of the track oh. in a great Super Mini battle, head over to GoPro Motorsports channel. That entire Moto GoPro from Dan and Reed is uh is up. Oh, Schoolboy One, Mikey Pillar, uh oh, Washington native, right? Yep. You yep. know, I'm pretty sure he got two as well. So uh, we might did. Wes he is did. blundering this. Dude. No, we went through. You went through all the classes, but I know Sorry. he got. I know he got two, which is why I know we're missing Sorry, a Mike. class. That means we're also probably missing other people. Hey guys, yeah. we're missing probably missing some results. We're tired. If we, we didn't say your name, I guarantee we got your photos. Guess what? We got we got results on vermoto.com. So sorry if we missed some results. Like, yeah. Well, Mikey's another one that we got a GoPro of uh, yeah. this week on a 125cc Yamaha to be exact, and, yeah. and it's a Blue super crew. badass. Uh, not bike of the year because the Yamaha 250F is bike of the year, but probably our second bike of the year. Yeah. Second bike of the year. Thanks, Yamaha. Uh, th- uh, third bike of the year. Is the and one, one yeah, more yeah, yeah. massive shout out we got to do, uh, and they hate this, but Gary, nah, he's Courtney, gonna hate us. Car- uh, the entire RMX crew, the Rabbit Pack, the Rabbit Pack. You guys are seriously the best promoters in this freaking business. Uh, uh-huh. We've worked with a lot of people. Um, so I'm sorry, all you other promoters that we work with. You're also great. You guys are uh, like one A. You're one A. Like well, I, I would say this. I'm I think every promoter we work with is awesome. uh, is on top, this level, but. It's it's awesome to come here. We we did the Gypsy 500 three weeks ago. Yeah, we spent a lot of time with the bras. And, and they uh, make it easy. Man. And now we got World Mini, and uh, yeah, they make it easy on us. They so give us easy. this gun club to edit. I can tell you that we don't have anywhere else that has AC uh, 
a bathroom. Waters. So, insane amount of space. Like ice. this is literally so, three thousand square foot space. So they're like, oh yeah, just use that so, down there. There's a couch for all of us so editing Gary, boys. Gary, I feel like we're sometimes like Gary's little kids. You know, yeah. we're just always like, oh, hey, definitely. He hey, Gary, what do you sense. think about this idea? And then Gary's, Gary's just like, come on, guys. Yeah. So yesterday, <laughs> we were uh, cleaning up some of our stuff, and I was like, go, Wes, whose are these? And he goes. I think they're Gary's. I was like, cool. You did not see me putting these in this box. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> I were pulling stuff out of the trailer and I was like, what are these? And will we ever use these? And he was like, oh, those are Gary's. And I see Gary over there going. <laughs> and, and I swear to God, I go, Gary, I'm not going to tell you what we took this time, but just know we took something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So thank you, Gary, for being you and yeah. and helping us put on a cool event. And you said it the before too. Event, like I, I say it all the time. We put on the event that we want to go to. We put on yeah. the event we never got to go to. Selfishly, we do these things for us. Because yes, we, we do. like having a good time. We like hooking kids up. We like watching dope dirt bikes yeah. race. You guys having fun is a byproduct. I come here for me. Yes, uh, but but give but seeing you guys do it, it's amazing. We can't do it without you guys buying shirts and coming yeah. to our races and having yeah. fun and. And uh, thank you. Put, putting one back at the end of the night. And it, it wasn't an easy week for them. We had no. two no. pretty brutal days of wind. Windy, windy days. Um, there's nothing you can do, and no. then, especially we're in the desert. Yeah. But they they told me the matrix of water hoses, fire hoses yeah, rather. They had a fire hose. They put out. They normally have multiple water trucks, but they weren't even able to spray in the right direction. So they put out a, two, over 2,500 feet of fucking fire hose. I'm just cussed on this. Unbelievable. But that's how much Blade. I needed to exaggerate or not exaggerate. Uh, <laughs> put an exclamation point on it. We still got five hours to talk on plop. Um, anyways, <laughs> have you ever rabbled, uh, rolled no. up a fire hose? Uh, no. Uh, like it that. took them six hours to roll this hose back up. Anyways, oh my God! When the wind started getting that bad, Gary was up there in the tower and he said, "How do we control this?" They knew he had six water pumps on standby that they went and put out on in their yeah. little reservoir thing, and they ran twenty five hundred feet. Oh my God! Of fire hose to be able to get to the places and control it the best they could. And on video, yes, it you know, you, they did everything they could. It, yeah. it it got gnarly. Yeah, they did more than they could. Speaking of the devil, is oh, he coming in? He's walking in, Gary. Himself. Come Gary, here, Gary. Come on, get come on, on podcast, buddy. Gary. We're talking podcast, about you. Gary, we're talking about you. Come on, Gary. This is the band. Here he is. This <laughs> he is the band. Coming to the he stage. He hates him so much right now. <laughs> coming to the stage. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on, Gary. Just, say, just come say hi. Yeah, just come say hi. Say thank you to everyone, and then yeah. we'll we'll let you go because Gary does not like this part of it. <laughs> this, this was 100 percent planned it was on the show rundown we knew he'd be here at yeah. exactly this time at 11 22 we knew he'd be walking in and we said we're gonna have gary on because right, he loves it podcast, so much gary bruff we uh we were literally just giving you props even though you uh absolutely hate it when we do that they are so humble here at uh Besquite rmx series uh but you walked in at the perfect time and uh it's now it's time you take your accolades like a real man <laughs> like a man gary why is there a lot of cash on there? Well, there? Gary, did well, you Gary, know that we're giving away 20 grand in cash, a Yamaha side by side, and two TTR 110s if you go to shopverb.com? For, okay. for every dollar you spend, you, you get, get one, one in entry. See the official rules for details, bus. please. <laughs> That's why there's 20 That's grand. That's why right there's there. 20 grand right there. You can 100% tell I did not expect any of this. No. no. Well, hey, I'm. You know, thank you, Gary. We just we, we wanted to say thank you. This is Gary, yeah. and what a great uh, way to wrap and this thing up. What a great up. family and uh, Gypsy Five Hundred. Now uh, you're about to sell our trailer for us that we're leaving yep. down here. Appreciate you putting that on marketplace for us. You get ten percent. <laughs> right, we need to be sweeped uh, out. Too, really, Gary. <laughs> really appreciate that. And um, so, anyways, uh, thank you so much for two epic and very successful events yeah, in a row. Amazing. And um, I'm amazing. pretty sure World Mini next year is going to go off. I'm happy with the event. Yes, 100%. Just not with yeah. us. Not with but, us. Uh, but 100%. <laughs> like nothing negative. Like this was the best. Have right. you ever seen any more people drink more beer than we do? <laughs> Our flaggers. Ah, uh, <laughs> the rabbit <laughs> Not Not during the not event. During yeah, not during the event. event. Not well, during. same. Well, same. Same. Yes, yeah. true, you get to true. celebrate a good day at the end yeah. of the day, yeah. right? Yeah. No, this was amazing. You guys are, you guys, you know what I think you guys. Yeah. I love working with you guys. It's nah. I'm, he said, "That's not what he said after the Gypsy Five Hundred. He's, uh, he's, he's, he's just putting on right now. I mean, like I said, I feel like we're his kids sometimes. Where he's like, uh, it's a love hate relationship. These guys, what are they doing? What are they getting me into now? I'm, I'm just smiling because I literally was just kind of like drinking coffee this morning, recovering. Went for a drive around the property, expected to see no one. Like I didn't even know you were. Still and here there. we still are. Yeah, here we yeah. still are working. Yeah. So like I, a little caught off guard. Like, <laughs> 
<laughs> he thought he was going to come down, roll into his office, and have, yeah, have a, a nice quiet. morning. Finally, some have peace and nice quiet. Morning. Yeah. <laughs> these, yeah. these, these dudes. Yeah. These guys, like, get them out of my life. I spent, I spent four days with, with Zach Heron and, and Kevin, Kevin Kelly. Kelly, which are amazing yeah. guys, like amazing. best announcers in the business. I mean, Kevin Kelly's the, the GOAT, in my opinion. Yeah. Like, so that was amazing. And then, yeah, just my kind of keep quiet, keep to myself. And, then all of a sudden, and now you have to talk even more. Yeah. 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 Kind of caught off guard. But no, this was a great event. Um, stayed on schedule. Uh, we didn't even discuss this, but no medicals. Are oh, you for real? Wow. Yeah. yeah. Dude, I've been meaning to yeah, ask I've you that. To you. Yeah. No medicals. There was full panic in the pits uh, Friday when there was two sheriffs, two angels. I saw that. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, the barbecue was that good. That this is where they came from. Oh, You're lying. No, 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 no. That's the truth. Like, dude, I was on the Gringer right well, from the he start comes line. Up and he goes, dude, there's four pit. troopers here. I did. I thought. <laughs> I, was I was like, like what's like, going on? Uh, I thought we were in a Taryn O'Dell mom and dad Loretta I situation. Know what was going on? Yeah, uh, that literally Courtney had um, 25 people ask her at the office, like, why is yeah, why oh is my the gosh. entire sheriff's department here? What, <laughs> what's going on? Why do we have multiple ambulances? <laughs> and they were sitting on the picnic tables, eating in, in front of. Yeah, we'll Tell them no more. We will bring it up to them. I'm really <laughs> glad I ate turkey sandwiches the yeah, whole week. Yeah. White, white boys tacos was that impressive. Wow. White boys tacos. Yeah. Yeah. Craig, Craig, Craig did have it every day. Yeah. Crane had Crane had it every day and yeah. ate yeah. all of Kevin Kelly's leftover mac and cheese wow. every day. Bro, every day. Wow. You didn't think to share any of this with no. us? I ate uh, I ate a hot turkey sandwich. <laughs> I ate one of those too. I ate three hot turkey yeah. sandwiches <laughs> but, all week. Disgusting. In, in all honesty, like. Our on-duty medics never treated anything more than, I mean, collarbones are going to happen yeah. in yep. the cross race, but like no one was transported, oh, no one was seriously well, injured. Well, that that speaks to hey. uh, how good of go the job you guys do, because I can tell you, I don't have a single thing to do with that. Hey, that's so, two events so in a row. So thank you, that's thank two you. That's, that's two in a row. Gypsy five hundred too. Hey, I got a couple collarbones. The was gyp gypsy was absolutely amazing to yep. think that there was eight hundred yep. unique motorcycles and. The skill level was from yeah Cody, from from Cody. west to yeah Cody Webb to west yeah exactly yeah, yeah, yeah. everything from west exactly to Cody exactly Webb. yeah <laughs> the, the sheer fact that the sheer fact that a Cody Webb didn't run over a Wes Williams yes level exactly of rider, yes like yeah we. That speaks I, to and you I felt safe out there the entire time. So that, that speaks to that's you guys, though, Gary. That's, no. that, that has nothing to do with Well, us. apparently, <laughs> when you have eight miles of beach sand and you just, the slow dude, Wes, just stays right, <laughs> and Cody Webb just blasts by you every 10 <laughs> seconds on the left. It works. It works. Yeah, the, really, the only thing in Riders Meeting for that one was in pit lane, pass on the left, because they could be exiting on the right. Yep. You just took the entire eight mile course. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Made it yeah. pit lane. It was yeah. like I was on Interstate 80 coming yeah. here, right? You just yep. stay on the right, dude. Yeah. If you yeah. got that trailer behind you and mm -hmm. you got to go 20 under the speed limit, just stay right, dude. Yeah. Short of having hazards, <laughs> like you did everything, everything. Thank you, dude. Yeah. He put one of those like things on the back of your car, the blinker or like the like hazard. Yeah, those lines, yeah. Just, like, we'll so work you, on that next year. You, you may say you have nothing to do with the safety, but you kept us all Thank safe. Thank you. <laughs> hey, just, staying in your lane. Just you stayed in your lane in all kinds of ways. You just, stayed in your lane. Just one more thing that I do to contribute exactly, to all of this. Dude. So you know what? I, I really got to pat myself yeah, on the back job, of the amount of things I do here that I you know sometimes I just don't even. <laughs> realize i appreciate your effort yeah. man i, I do I oh really my gosh well we got to pack up all this stuff gary it might and take multiple more hours you're gonna have to talk to us even more uh then crane has to drive and then we're going to pulp to talk about world mini on yeah, pulp more more talking. so after an hour of talking we have five more hours of talking to do i'm sure Wait, you're Steve. really sad that you don't come get to join us on that but Pulp threatened some lawsuits about the number of bumps that were on the deck. <laughs> so if you could get us out of that. Okay, we'll work like, on it. Work uh, on that. Well, we got him a new amateur. AC's out. New, no, 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 no. Jaden's our amateur. We got. We'll figure that out. No, Jaden's ours. We'll, yeah, we'll was, give him Jet Rao. He was no, very, we'll take Jet. Very we'll upset one. with the number of bumps on the deck. Mm. Oh, so if you can negotiate, you can get us out of hot water there. <laughs> All right, we'll, yeah. we'll see what we can we'll do. We'll see what we can do, what we can do Gary. Yeah. We're gonna have to get him to sign yes, before we actually go on yes. on air. Because hey, if we're if we're not there, he doesn't really have a show tonight. Can we just like from now on get like uh, Steve's own personal waiver? So it's not like a, it's not a standard waiver. It's right? like fourteen pages. Yeah, it's like seventeen you can't pages. Sue us. You can't talk about this. You can't sue us about this. There there was dirt on the track, guys. There's dirt and there's it's it's like not ninety degrees. It's seventy eight. <laughs>
It's way too cold for me it's to ride. Way too cold. It's a little wind. <laughs> hey, and props to Riley, your son. Oh yes, Riley. We, we already gave all him the props. Bras, all the two bras. championships, and he was watering at three a.m. with two kids. Yeah, small kids. Yeah, that that wind on Thursday and Friday was rough, and you can't water on. It, it, yeah. yeah, we we went. Through, I told him that you unraveled yeah, twenty five hundred yeah. feet of a uh, fire hose. The fact that you have twenty five hundred feet of yeah, fire hose. Fire hose. <laughs> that's not something I keep in my garage. No, so no. props to you, man. Yeah. Yeah. No. It. The whole thing was good. Like we have from. From Cody Webb to Wes Williams. We yes, everything exactly. On site ready I, only go. thing I got to tell you, Gary, uh, I would love to ride um, next year, but I only really want my moto to be from like the, the 8 a.m. moto to like maybe noon. After that, unless we could do like a full reprep, I don't know that I no. really, I don't really want any 4 p.m. moto. No, so next year, if I do like plus 30, can we just make sure all the plus 30 motos are before noon? Yes. We can work on that because something that was pointed out to me you realize the 65s, the way this stacked yes. up? Oh, man. Uh, you got yeah, they had, and the 50s. I think the yeah. 50 shaft drive. They had to ride the corners of the track. That that one day, what was it, Friday and Saturday night? Yeah. It, it, the track was rough. Yeah. Is yeah. It? Yeah, the 65s got the 430, 445 moto two days. In All right, so how about this? Plus 30, you, you go do a full re reprep, then it's my class, <laughs> and then the 65s can go. So hold on. That's right. If, <laughs> What is your class? <laughs> we don't know. You just said plus thirty, but you didn't include yourself. Well, what is your class? I mean, I, we we <laughs> only have two vet classes 40. right now, right? We did plus twenty five, plus thirty five, or plus thirty. If we decide to expand on that, I mean, I'd probably prefer to do plus thirty five B C. Can I do D? Can we get a D in there? Plus thirty five D. I don't want to be in a D class. So I'll do B C. I'll do D. Um, just be so, by myself. You know what? That, that brings up a good point. If the vets come and support us. I think we should add more vet classes, but yeah. until you know, until I even want to ride this race, which unless I get a full reprep, I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. Um, but uh, I don't know. So as it stands, I'd do plus thirty, which means I'd be you know your son would have to battle me. Oh, that's gonna be tough. Chris Kiefer, your son. Yeah, well, I'll be out there. It's gonna be tough because when they come around to lap him for the fifth time, it's like God dang it, Wes, get out of the way. I'm trying to win a race. <laughs> Four lap motor, Chase. Oh, five okay, give exactly. Me more, give me more credit than that. Exactly. Well, okay, so three and a half times. Chase didn't even – he saw the Gypsy 500 <laughs> course not. and didn't even okay. put on his boots. Okay. All right, so I'm let's good. give someone shit Hey, here. actually, I gave my, my spot away to a guy who blew up his bike. So, actually, I'm a very uh, yeah. good person. Yeah. No, it, I mean, the 65s getting those late motos was interesting, but it was cool. Like, it didn't shake anything up. Like, hmm. Jaden Smart was still the man. Yep. Like, yep. He was – but it was props to those little dudes. It was rough. It got yeah. chopped. It is rough. badass. See yeah. that the fact that they can go out there and handle that because uh, I that's I guess that's my point. I could not have. <laughs> I would have been like, "Where's my beer?" Thankfully, yeah. this track is not built for people like you and I. <laughs> I know. I, that's kind of my point too. This is a national caliber race, not yeah. a uh, Wes Williams. It's not, not a Wes Williams, Williams it, chase, chase. Wait, race. this one's not a endurance event. <laughs> yeah, but no, it, it, it was from from the wind to. I mean, look at today. Ah, it's beautiful. Like it's beautiful. Like beautiful. What, if we were one day, but one. it's just that's the desert. Yeah. We're gonna get that. Well, could, I mean, could you just ask the weatherman next year? Let's yeah. just make sure the wind stays away. But that, even Jason Baker, who drove all the way out here, um, I was like, hey man, just let you know, last year we didn't have one day of wind. This year too. Luckily, the last two days were perfect yeah. though. So Gypsy five hundred zero wind. Yeah. So you know what? Well, yeah. beggars can't be choosy. We're stoked. Yeah. And you guys did a great job. The overall vibe yes. of the event was oh, awesome. Amazing. amazing. I swear I didn't hear one. One complaint, Gary. So, and I tried. I tried to get people to complain to me, <laughs> and they didn't. Maybe they're scared of you, or maybe they're scared of me because I'm I very intimidating. You. I doubt they were scared of you. <laughs> we got we got one text. One text. Yeah. Wow. One text was anonymous. Said uh, three fifteen PW fifty moto track is very ready. Okay, that's not Today. bad. It's a very good observation by someone. Yeah. Yeah. So. so. Yeah, hey, that's some, it. One, one, th one. Text. Which we already addressed that. So yeah, cool. Yeah. So so again, uh, as long as my moto goes before the fifty moto <laughs> next time next year, we're good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Reprep for PW fifties yeah. and Wes Williams moto, whatever we call yeah. it. Doug Dubok hey, did. On. Hey, Doug Dubok did say he'd race me if we had an industry, can, industry class. Can, can we get the Wes versus the P Dubs and see who wins? <laughs> I think I might could win the P Dub class. I could yeah. not be Jaden Smart. I'll you could not be Jaden Smart. No I tell you that. Not even on a fifty. <laughs> You're not being Jet Rao. I couldn't be Jet Rao either. You're not being Jet Rao. I could with some training on the no. 50, not the 65s. On no. a, dude, there's I'll no way a 50. Jet, Jet, if you're listening oh, to this, Gary's I will put, me, Gary's I will put like, my I money. Don't know. I will put my money on Jet Rao. I, I've heard. I made Loretta's before. 
I made Loretta C class. class. Who cares? C class 2002. I had Jeff Alessi, Mike LaPaglia, Jimmy Albertson. Hey, dude. can we check these results, please? Yeah, they're real. He's okay. The they're real. Okay. Like, I was in a very fast C class, bro. Okay. Okay. Bro. That was 30 years ago. I know. <laughs> I still got it up here, dude. Do I still have it right here? <laughs> I don't know. We'll find out next yeah, year. Chet Rao, if you're listening, please let us set this up. I would love to race. I think it'd be very gnarly for us to come do all this, though, and, uh, and, and ride. We're not, we're not ride. We're not the bra kids, dude. We can't do all that. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? We'll leave that to them. We'll I'll, leave that to them. I'll stick with the Gypsy 500 because yes. that was awesome. Yes. I'll stick with the uh, Gringer pit bike races. So. All yeah. right. Well, that's that. World Mini 2024. Yeah. That's a wrap. Thank you, Gary. Thank Gary Bruff. Thank you Bruff. so much. Thank you, Chase. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you Chase. Chase. Jason, for, <laughs> for, tired. for not sharing your burritos, even telling me you had a burrito or your mac and cheese. Yeah. That's a dick move. It was, it was a taco, and it was Kevin's mac and cheese. Uh, See, did you he not saved think, his money. My name on it, literally. And guess who he's billing for all of this? And he didn't even bring us one. He didn't bring me one. All Next week. year, World Mini 2024, <laughs> we will resurrect all of these issues. Demerit cream. <laughs>